Hello my friends, welcome to the new playthrough. This is game, yes your grace, but it's not completely blind playthrough. Basically, I played it about 2.5 hours at some point, and then I stopped. If I remember correctly, I stopped because decisions was too hard, it kind of went against my personality, like, I'm used to, you know, help people, people and stuff. And but there it's a bit harder, you need to make hard decisions. I have a 5 out of 35 achievements completed. But I think it, there is a lot left to play. So we will try again. I decided to do it because I need to clear out my Steam library, there are too many games that I need to finish. I don't want to delete them because they are not finished, basically. So let's do this. Beginning w is known. As you understand, but I will tell you when I run to the place I haven't been before. So, also, there is some kind of music in the background which I hate. But I think it's not in the video for some reason, so it's fine. Uh, yes, your grace, it's game of tough choices. It will be impossible to satisfy the needs of every petitioner. Sometimes your subjects will have spiteful intentions and sometimes life will get in the way if you simply have enough resources at the end of each week that's good enough okay let's see what it's what's in store it's been very long time actually so maybe they did some updates this castle is so ugly though i wonder if uh, in reality king lived in such ugly place I assume they did try to make it prettier, you know, they put up those swords and candlesticks or whatever you call them. But it still looks kind of... Uh, looks very cold. Click on the petitioner to call them forward. Andri Au Audrey. It is time, your grace. Click on the throne to step down. I had better put on the crown. Yeah, of course. If you want to go out. Explore the rooms to find items of interest. You can find your inventory in the lower left corner. Select an item to interact with it. Uh, it's getting a bit rusty. Oh, now it says. Wear it. You can leave any room by walking to the edge of the screen or by selecting the doors. Okay, let's walk to the screen. This is a map of your castle. Click on the castle wall to go there. A red brick castle? What is this, England? Although there was no red brick castles in England. Red brick houses appear later, I think. It was some boom or technology of making them or whatever. Although, you know, I have never been in any castle in England, so maybe they are red brick. I know churches are sandstone, so I assume castles are... Well, sandstone castle would be weird. You can break it easy. Okay, it doesn't matter. Uh, map castle, click on the castle walls to go there castle walls. Your grace. Yes, it's me. A deserter. Found one of our hiding in a shed. Found one of ours hiding in a shed. Shed? Why would you do this, Sobik? There's too many of them. We have no chance of winning. If you let him off, the rest may follow. Okay, that is the thing. First hard choice. If battle is lost, is it wrong to let him go? Like, he said, rest will follow. Well, I would tell them to follow. 
if well you know he says there are too many of them is it true like we don't know it if I would be king I would assess situation is it winnable or not maybe it's not winnable so running away it's just fine we all gonna die anyway However, our army is sparse as it is. We need every set of hands able to hold sword, your grace. Even the last brave soldier are essential now. There is no place for cowards under my banner. Kill. I think as a ruler, most likely best thing would be kill. Because how to say it fear keeps people in line if they think they can walk over you they will it's actually true even in the simple like everyday job in companies if you allow people you know to be late five minutes or, or take phone calls or whatever they will take more and more it's just how they do you need to be firm As a person who would never go to war myself of, of free will, I would th think that this is better, because if I would be in f his position, I would also desert. What's the point fighting lose battle? I am better off alive somewhere. Well, you know, even if I am loyal to King Well, I just love myself more. I can help him if I must, but not uh, with cost of my life. There are like levels of help. You know, it's like company. You can't take overtime if they ask you, but it's not like you're gonna jump on, on front of a car for your boss. No, well, not very same, but you know, you get the point. There are things like I'm willing to do and things I'm not willing to do. What to do with deserter? This is hard times. Damn it. So hard. Sometimes I think if my inability to make hard choices makes me weak. That is it reflect somehow in my life. Like, I don't have such a hard choices in life. It's al always simple. But is it somehow reflects anyway? Okay, I let him go just because we are losing. With courage, we will defeat the enemy, no matter the odds. Let him lose, General. Go and stand for Davern. Thank you, Your Grace. Over here, Your Grace. I still feel I did wrong choice. Needed to kill him, but okay. How bad is it, General? Our men are scared. It's the middle of the night, and yet it's so bright. As if... Svarog himself walked our lands. Who is Svarog? It's that thing from the Lord of the Rings? The devil who lived in the Moria? The thin walls won't last long and we lack any solid defense, defense measures. We don't have enough men. Once they get in, we have nothing we can throw their way. Can you hear the chanting? They're getting ready. We better get started. Okay, that is one thing I always wanted to think out. If in reality something like this happen, you are a ruler and there are a bunch of outside ready to attack, what would happen if you throw out all the money, all the gold with the catapults just outside? First of all, it would, it would make ruckus between soldiers, because they just earned money, why would they need to fight you? <coughs> they made fight themselves, who gets that, you know, golden uh, spoon or whatever, or golden penny. I guess they don't pay much anyway, so for them it would be like, you can take this and earn more than you would here risking your life, that's the first. Second, if they throw everything out, 
what's the point attacking if you don't gaining anything? Of course you overthrow me and you can take this place, but at the same time it's it becomes straight away very expensive. Because you know you're not gonna earn anything. You're simply gonna lose army. It's just interesting, would it be possible with this way to repel attack? Like if there is no other choice to win, you just throw a valuable stuff outside with the catapults. Okay. I have g gathered archers from all o other walls. They are awaiting you at the wall, your grace. There is still time to put up white flags. You know there is one thing about white flags. I think I would never do it in life. Because you put white flag because you fear your life. But usually they kill you anyway. It, they throw you in the dungeon or torture or whatever. Some of them may survive. But in reality I think it's... It's just suicide. You know it's like right now Russia and Ukraine. If you are Ukrainian and Russians take your town or whatever. I don't think something good awaits you even if you surrender. It's all in your hands now, your grace. In my hands. I need to go there? Yes. Oh yeah, this is a lot of camps. Sons of Darwin. Okay, there is a thing. Speech. Straight away attack. This is not winning at all. And they are way too far for arrows to reach. I would ne really need to read history a bit more. To know if white flag was ever right choice. Was ever a time that... You weren't tortured later. Maybe some soldiers would survive. King? Probably never. Killed straight away. It's the best way you get killed. Most likely thrown into dungeon for life. Okay, let's make some speech. My brothers, we stood together through the worst of times. We have proved our strength in many battles, and today we will prove it again. My bravest man, I bid you to fight for all you hold dear. For Darwin. Our... Well, shouldn't say R because you don't rushing into fight now. You just keep standing on the wall. It's just weird. Could just say attack. Yeah, we're not gonna last long. But breaking uh, walls of a castle isn't easy. One year earlier. This is, uh, is still I have done. Three, two, one. Ok, I come. Who is this? Lord Sui. If I remember, this is my daughter and this is my wife and there should be one more daughter somewhere. You found me well done, father. Come on now, Lord Sulia. It's not often that we can do this. She's too big for games. I told you I don't want to play. Aren't you too old for this? Lord Sulia, that's no way to speak to your father. Oh my god. Lord Sulia is sick in the... Rusilia is stick in the mud. Shut it, Aselia. Is Aselia supposed to be Arya? We can see you from miles away. Poor Ned. What did Kingslayer said about him? Uh, uh, something terrible, judgment. 
Got you. Should have insulted your sister from across the guard. Shouldn't have insulted your sister from across the gardens. She always has to ruin everything. She's so proud. She couldn't even find place to hide. It wasn't even trying. I wasn't even trying to hide. I don't want to play. Next time you don't want to play, maybe try writing a formal announcement. Oh wait, you can't write. Of course I can. You need to it. Cut it out, both of you. Please, they just fight, whatever. Oh, you know I am not playing with you, darling. The sun finally come out. Let me enjoy it. Yeah, in the winter you need sun. What is this little girl? Cadenia. And here is the little one. No! I was doing so well. You must have cheated. Or peaked. I demand another trial of the game. How official, ha? Huh? Maybe next time, Z. Basically her name, Z Denny or whatever. Forgive me, your grace. I hate to interrupt, but your subjects will soon arrive. Alright, enough games. The throne awaits. <laughs> what a psycho. Plays for 30 seconds with his daughters and thinks he's a good father. The petitioners will start queeing in the moment, your grace. We really need to shorten the visiting hours. Okay, I guess this is... Well, I know that this is my things. I just didn't play for a long time, I don't even remember. I guess this is the sulfur. I'm just joking. Gold. Wheat. I guess size of an army. Uh, I guess happiness of people. I do not know what that could be. I do not know what that could be. Aurelia. What do you want? Can you go and speak to Lorsulia, my dear? I've tried talking to her, but she just won't respond. I don't know what's got into her recently. Maybe she will open up a bit more to you. She's probably wondering about the wall. What wall? Of course my sweet... Uh, uh, something sweet... Uh, sweetheart or sweetest... Didn't read. Okay, some kind of dungeon guard. Your grace! I bring bad news. The recent rains have soaked through the ro our roofs. The pantry roof has collapsed. As well as so some walls of our dungeons. Or dungeon. Only one cell is currently functional. We should really fix those things before they get worse. Otherwise, we'll keep losing supplies. You will see the re required fixes in your weekly summary at the end of the week. When you meet people and talk to the petitioners, your advisor makes a note about the encounter in your archive. You can see all the entries by clicking on the archives button below. Archives. Completed entries, nothing. I guess these just people. Oh, okay, let's read about them. I kind of know. This is the... The Queen of Darwin, of oh, I his daughter, Elric's wife and mother of the three daughters, so I have no son. She is always happy to advise the king on important matters, okay. Zedny, youngest daughter, she observes her sisters and lands quickly, often mimicking their actions. Asalia is Arya, middle daughter, Asalia is adventurous and playful and doesn't care what others think about her. And this one is, uh, what was her name, also from Game of Thrones? Uh, Arya's sis a sister. Oh, my brain doesn't work. Don't remember names. I have to now. Otherwise it's gonna bother me. Sansa, yeah. Not very similar, so she's not gonna be Sansa. The oldest daughter is smart, polite, and learns quickly from her mistakes. She is 13. I think Sansa also about the same age. That's the family stuff, not important. P 
people's needs, flood danger, the recent rainy w weather damaged our pantry, roof and dungeon. We should repair the damage when possible. I think this is important. If I would be a king, I would do it. Like maybe I wouldn't care much about dungeon. Although it's also good to have some free sale if somebody betrays you. But uh, pantry, broken pantry is no no. It need to be fixed. Like sooner or later you will have to fix it. You just cannot exist with broken pantry. So you will have that how to say you will need to pay those expenses at some point. So you better pay them quickly. So you don't lose the grain. That's my take on it. Who is this peasant? Your grace, my daughter's wedding is at hand. A and congratulations. The problem is we don't have enough gold or supplies to make worthy feast. What will my daughters in love think of our family? We want to hire a band, buy some that fancy wine on the market. We would only need five gold and five supplies. Pfft, what is this? Is this a joke? You know... <laughs> I have played this before, as I said. This is still part I have played. And I think first time I also didn't give him, because now I rem remember that it's just nonsense. You go to king and ask money for your wedding? Just don't do wedding if you don't have money. What the heck? If I will give him now, every peasant will come and ask for wedding. So no, it's your expenses. The kingdom has more important matters at hand. We shall daughter the best. You skimp us little gold? Should the king support his people in the hard times? Can feed my guests with the king's blessing? He should have... Um, uh, haggled a bit more. If he would say, well, at least give me a bit of food, I may actually broke break for him. Next. Your grace, I come here representing my village. We, we want to ask you for seven gold to help us gather tools and resources required to build an inn. We could really use new place to rest after a long day work. That would increase people's happiness. But who gonna earn money from inn? Because inn is a, a establishment that earns, how to say, a business. Yeah, you know, there is the thing. I would pay him if I would hear more. I'm afraid if I click this, he just may run away straight away. That was was about this game, now I remember. These things. Like... If I click, there will be more haggle. I guess we built in. I would need to know who owes it in the end. Maybe crown itself. Okay. Make in the best... Okay, one happiness, that's good. Make it best in a round. Oh, we surely will. Thank you, guys. Also, I wouldn't actually give him money. I would hire some other pa people. How can you trust some, such a man? There should be my own person who builds it and on oversees it. Not some peasant. Monsters. Beasts dressed in black. They came in the night. Unseen and heard until they arrived, they attacked the village. We heard the dreadful screams of the slain. Your grace, I beg you, you must send your men check what happened. Find those re responsible. Oh, this is important actually. Some kind of bandits attacking town at night? This cannot happen. Tell me more. Who are you? Bright red heads, short but sharp fangs. Hundreds of them. Gleaming metal for the claws. We never seen anything like this. My general should deal with these bandits easily. Thank you, your grace. Okay, general is out. 
click on the uh, glowing flower to advance to the next week once you're ready. Sometimes you will need to see your family members before you can advance. Yeah, I also want to give the money for that dungeon. Help with wedding. A peasant asks for a gold. How much gold he wanted? Just one piece? Maybe I should have given him. And supplies to fund his daughter's wedding. The king declined to ig decided to ignore the request. I think rightfully so. On the other hand, it depends how big is our village or our city or whatever. You know, if we if we rule over hundred people, we are al almost like family. Everybody knows everybody. Would be nice to give him. If I have like ten thousand men, of course not. I cannot. Uh, uh, how? You, what's the word? Basically, I cannot pay for every man's wedding in the, in the kingdom. <coughs> okay, enough talks. Where is that man who wants... Tell me about the kingdom. What do you like? Resources? We have to control four resources to keep our kingdom running smoothly. Gold supplies, gold supplies, army and contentment. We need to distribute gold and supplies to our petitioners. If they are happy, their contentment will grow. A strong kingdom needs a big army to gain more soldiers. For our army we we'll need to make alliances with the neighboring lords. We can gain resources through taxes as well from the alliances we make with lords. Okay, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I still don't understand how I give money to that. This thing. No. Flu damage. This one. Maybe I need to go around. Is this there? Dungeon. Blue icons indicates important matters to attend to green icon show optional conversation. There is no blue. Oh, this is blue. Okay, let's go to dungeon. It feels important. Damn it, this is worse than I thought. This? The recent downpours have damaged a, a lot of buildings, your grace. Well, we still have space for prisoners, we should focus on buildings that need more attention. I've had a scribe write a list of things that needs to be fixed. You will see this in your weekly summary, your grace. That sounds like it's going to be costly, yes. No, it's fine. Who are you? By all the gods. That could have been me. Your grace, do you see what happened here? If I was in that other cell, I would have been crushed. This is a sign. The gods have forgiven my sins. I shall serve the mighty ones. I will dedicate my life to those in need. That's like... I mean, if I could get out of here, please. Why are you here again? I bumped into the innkeeper on the street and stomped his toe. How dare you tell such a falsehoods. He ordered a gallon of be beer, drank it all by himself. I didn't even have the gold to pay for it. Uh, I would say that the innkeeper is fault faulty why he gives before payment payment of up front always I know the innkeeper he's pretty upset 
Oh yes, I think I remember. Your grace, I have been enlightened. I won't ever do such stupid things again. I will save higher purpose now. Just maybe... Let me out. No, sit there more. I think you will need more... Some more time to think about your actions. God has spared my life for a reason. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay man. Oh, what kind of entry? Divine intervention. I wonder if I free him. Would happiness increase or decrease? Also, you know, that's not divine intervention. If something breaks where you're not there. Because you can tell about everything like that. I don't know. Car hits the pole. You wasn't there. So it's divine intervention. Didn't hit you. It would be divine intervention if he would be there and he survives. Then maybe I would believe. Okay, what's there? Some daily, uh, optional stuff. Vasali, is this wife or daughter? Yes, father. Can you explain the fight in the gardens? What is matter with you two? You and Lorsulia used to be best friends. You mean why is Lorsulia such a big baby? This is kind of things I mean. She's annoying, it's is all. This isn't going anywhere, is it? How can both of you be so stubborn? You're not going to let her off, are you? Not until she stops being such a pain. If she wasn't so annoying, I wouldn't have to insult her. And so will come for circle. I guess. I didn't even ask first thing. I do not like such a things. You shouldn't fight, you shouldn't fight. No, you should fight. It's alright. What I'm doing here? Checking that broken pantry? Or what it was? Is this? It looks alright. Oh, that's wall. Looks nice without army. Lorsulia. Oh, it's you. You need to stop fighting with your sister. Do you want to talk about what happened in the gardens? No. I'm fine, father. I can see something wrong. Why won't you talk to me? Everything's fine. Don't you have things to do? I'll leave you for it. Leave you to it. Sure. I could ask everything, but if I play it as a real life, I do not like to press on people. I just would ask her later, uh, again. Okay, I do not know how we end... Uh, ...pay for that roof or whatever, I just click, maybe that's gonna be here. This is your weekly summary screen. Here you will be able to see your kingdom's weekly incomes and expenses. You can buy upgrades and fix fixes for castle in the left section. To buy an upgrade, simply click on the button with the upgrade name and you will see cost added to the summary. So... Pantry roof costs 12. You see broken pantry roof, it removes 5 grain every time, I guess every week. So this we need to fix. Market style. Gain 2 gold for we per week. Waste 15 grain. Repair theater. Removes containment penalty from treasury. Ah. From treasury? This I guess. Ah, treasury is this. Yeah, so basically because of theater we don't have... Okay, first of all, let's fix this. 
and fix this. This is important. We can't keep losing a grain every week. We, we're gonna run out of food like in... Uh, Well, we, we, we would not run out of food, because we lose only 5 and we gain 8. So every week we get 3 more. But you know, it's like 3 weeks and and we lost 15. And that's the cost of this. Yeah, so we fix that definitely. Extra gold would be nice. Theater. We don't have much money, so I think I leave theater for now. I, I don't even know what exactly this thing does. Also, I think it's enough for me today. Thanks for watching, and I see you tomorrow.